Hello everyone, welcome back to the Sims 3 100 Baby Challenge. This is episode 74. And Nova is married now. Her and Arnolfo have gotten married. They don't live together though, but they're married. So that's awesome. And our toddlers are ready to age up, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Um, and the babies are just kind of chilling at the moment. I'm going to have him come, well, no, never mind. I was going to have him come in, but I don't really need to do that. So you continue painting. Here, you feed your babies. And we're going to go ahead and age up the toddlers real quick. Because they're in really, really good mood. So I figure, why not? And is she pregnant again? You know what? Actually, I don't think she is. I don't think so. Oops. Alright, we're going to call up Leonard McGraw real quick. And get pregnant with him. Because I don't think she's pregnant. I just realized that. Alright. Here, we'll go ahead and age up the twins real quick. The set of twins, anyway. Trigger age transition. And I'm going to be jumping around a lot in this episode, like I usually do. Or like I have been, I guess, lately, I should say. All right, well, we can change that. In res, master controller, by over. Hmm, bro, no, not relation. Long-term relationship, that's what I wanted. Distant friend, Leonard McGraw. Thank you, Leonard, for being oh so cooperative. Alright, we're going to age up this one now. There we go. And here's a piece of artwork finished. And we'll keep that one because it's pretty cute. Oh, these opportunities, man. Uh, let's do medium now. Alright, so our friend is here. This is a good sense of humor. Nice. Alright, invite inside. Everyone's in pretty good moods. Alright, let's get this done. Be a little bit friendly. Okay. I guess we'll go ahead. I need to unlock the door, though, before I forget. Unlock. There probably won't be a baby in this episode, considering that we didn't um, get her pregnant <laughs> early enough. But that's okay. Okay, go on. No. No. Oh, they're playing. That's so cute. Alright, here we go. Showtime. Fantastic. We are pregnant once again. Perfection. Ask to leave. And we're going to sell that. Awesome. So very awesome. Oh, and the teenagers are home. I guess I brought someone with them, so that's great. Whatever. Um, let's take care of the adults real quick. Oops. All right, I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and just skip it here. I know I probably shouldn't, but really, I'm just going to take care of everyone and get them started on homework. And I just don't really tend to do a lot of commentary when I do that because I try to focus probably a bit too much, but it's just how I am. So I think I will just skip it. This way we can kind of get a little bit further along with everything and get stuff happening. You know how I like to do things. Actually, we're going to do his homework first and then he'll eat. Alright, well I'm going to skip it here and I will see you guys in a little bit. Hello everyone, and we are back and everyone is asleep, but we are going to go ahead and <clears throat> oh, sorry, we're going to go ahead and age up the babies because <clears throat> 
Lavetta is showing now. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, age him up real quick. So we're gonna, I guess, I, I don't know, uh, start with, I don't know, we'll start with Alyssa, whatever. Trigger her age transition. And we'll start working on teaching them to walk and talk and everything like that. If they age up. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and trigger his age transition. And we're going to go ahead and put Alyssa in a walker. Why does that keep happening? I keep getting all these thought bubbles in the kids' room. There we go. We're going to put Ace in the walker. And we're just going to have her watch TV for a little while. See? Do you see what I'm saying? Look at all of these. Like, what is going on? Change to kids. And then you guys are going to learn to walk. And I'm going to go ahead and skip it here I think um, now that they're aged up because we still have a lot that we that could happen within this episode we might have a baby because I was hoping that these like six teenagers would get on honor roll and I don't know why they didn't but they didn't so I was hoping that we'd have those birthdays but we might end up with uh, babies instead but whatever I'm gonna go ahead and skip it here and we'll return later all right everyone we're back again and we are going to go have some babies we I've had to play through the entire weekend, so it just worked out kind of this way. Also, um, the twins, the toddlers are ready to age up also. So, I mean, I'm probably going to go ahead and do that. I see no reason why not. A formal dance is happening. They probably won't go, honestly, because they have to be getting onto honor roll, like, soon. And, honestly, prom will probably be much later and I don't really care if they go or not I kind of just would like them to be out of the house so some of them will get to go but some probably won't and that's okay all right so we are going to meet her over at the hospital and then we'll probably age up the twins and then we'll see where we're at at that point hopefully we get triplets I want triplets we haven't had triplets in a long time it's kind of starting to bother me. <laughs> I don't know why we're not having twins. <laughs> All right. Speed this up a little bit. I'm sorry that... Oh, we have a baby girl. So we're going to name her Sophia. Okay. And she is virtuoso and grumpy. And we have a baby boy who we'll be naming Tegan. Okay, and he is good and friendly, and really? Okay, I was like, really, twins again? And we have another baby girl, and we're going to name her Sydney. Okay, and she gets good and virtuoso. All right, that is awesome, 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 awesome. I'm so glad that we finally had triplets again. And Leonard actually is dead, he passed away before they were born. That's okay. So we have Sophia, Tegan, and Sydney, which is really exciting. Really, really exciting. Okay. And we have a lot of babies in the household. Lots of people in the household right now. So what do they need? Um, two of them need to be fed, and then one of them is fine. So cool. Oh, boy. I think I figured out what the problem was, and... With how big the room is, it was like she couldn't hear the music. So I had to move the stereo over to her. So it was basically like they didn't have any music in the house. Which is weird, but whatever. Alright, so she needs to eat. So you are going to feed Sophia. Actually, we'll do this. Okay. And you'll put her back in the crib, and I think this is the other one that needs to eat as well. And you will feed Tegan. What are you doing? Wait, is he tired? Okay, then yes, you can put him in the crib. And 
Is she tired? Yes. Well, we'll let them sleep. We'll, we'll let them sleep and then we'll worry about, I don't know. There's so many things, so many babies and whatnot going on. Alright, she's fine, so we'll just go ahead. Uh, don't know where everybody is. Put Sydney in the crib and put Tegan in the crib. And you can put uh, Alyssa in the crib. Alright, let me see. What do we have going on here? Okay, so she's fine. Oh dear. Let us, uh, let's take care of some people real quick. Shower. Sleep. Alright, well, we have that. So, let's see. How's everybody else doing? We're just gonna go ahead and put, I guess, everyone to bed, more or less. Oh, she was already going. Well, he's fine. I have a feeling he probably went ahead and slept at some point, which was not really what he was supposed to do. But it's okay. Oh, she's sleeping already. So is she. Cool. He's fine. So some of them are fine, which is really kind of weird. Alright, so everyone's in bed pretty much, more or less. We'll probably go ahead and put these... The ones who are awake, let me find them. I think it's just, we're gonna go ahead and put them to bed as well. Mm. Oh, don't do that. All right, I think that's everyone, yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and put all of them in bed because why not? No! You're supposed to be putting the kid in the crib, you little dunce. What are you doing? Alright. Alright, cool. So we're good. Um, I guess we should probably invite someone to go ahead and have a baby with. I don't know if we have really anyone to do that with, though. Have we had a kid with Lloyd Sekimoto? We might do that with him. He's not related to us. Let's find out. Actually, I have, I think, all of them written down. Hold on, let me see. Okay, so we had Rocco, Bronson, Eliza, Colleen, Garrett, Carla, Quincy. They're from Leonard. Let me make sure. Yeah, I don't think we've used Lloyd, so we'll go ahead and uh, we'll invite him over. Why not? Get pregnant again. Look at that. Oh my gosh. So let's just let's just take a look at our family tree real quick. Uh, how many babies we have? We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 babies. You guys, 21 babies. Oh my goodness. All right, let's invite him inside. Okay. We're already friends, so I see no reason why not to just go ahead and jump in. Well, let's be, let's have, you know, let's be cordial, I guess. Uh, let's see, ask about his day. What are you doing? Come on. What are you doing? Go. Oh, jeez. We don't got time for this. Harper baby with Lloyd. Let me make sure I have never used Lloyd. I just want to make sure. No, no Lloyd. This won't necessarily be um, our last kid or anything like that. Just to let you guys know. Because we we're, we have to step out 10 days until we're an elder. So I think we, we could probably have one more baby after this one. So I'll just have to find someone to do that with. There we go. Pregnant again. We're on a roll, you guys. Who is this? Bronson. Oh, okay. We have a baby with him. Alright, well, let's ask him to leave and uh, we'll end it there. Bye. Thanks. See ya. Alright. 
Well, we're going to go ahead and end it here. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry that this video um, went up so late today, but that kind of just sometimes happens. I, I've been kind of... I usually record the night before, but I've kind, I haven't really done that lately, um, unfortunately. Sorry about that. Um, so I'm just trying to remember who this, who their baby daddy is. It's Leonard who? Leonard McGraw. I just want to write this down so I don't forget. Alright, and I think we're almost at 50, you guys. Just to let you guys know, I think we're almost at 50. I kind of wanted, that's kind of one of the reasons why I'm still recording because I'm writing down. We have 47 babies. So we need one more set of triplets and we're at 50, you guys. We're at halfway and we're only in generation three, which is pretty outstanding. So um, thank you guys so much for watching again and I will see you in the next episode. Bye.